it begins with a line on paper, a curve, a measure, a vision. From that line, steel is cut, blocks are raised, sparks fly. Inside the shipyard, men and machines labor together, turning raw slabs into a body of steel, into a giant. A shipyard is not a factory. It is a forge where floating cities are born. And tonight, you will witness the making of one, stone by stone, no, steel by steel. From blueprint to cargo giant, this is how the lifeblood of global trade takes shape. What do you think about this change here? That could work, but we need to consider the load balance. I have a solution for that. Is no. We need to ensure the new design optimizes for both cargo capacity and fuel efficiency. Perhaps a slight adjustment to the hull. From blueprint to steel, from sparks to waves, a cargo giant is born. It will carry the lifeblood of trade across oceans, connecting nations, feeding cities, fueling worlds, built by hand, by fire, by endurance. It now belongs to the sea. I think if we adjust the central mechanism here, yeah. That could increase efficiency by at least 15%. Let's cross-reference that with the structural integrity reports. But cut steel is only fragments. Fire must bind them, seam by seam, until strength replaces weakness. Plates become walls, walls become blocks. And only when blocks rise together does a hull begin to breathe. Pull, pull, pull! 
Watch your hands. From the skeleton of steel, a floor emerges. Above it, towers climb. The shape begins to look less like a yard and more like a ship. Up, up, up. Move it into position now. Lower it slowly. Watch that side. Hold it steady. Almost there. Slowly, slowly, that's it. but a body is hollow without a heart. Deep inside, the engines descend, and veins of pipes and wires carry life through the steel. When the heart beats, the skin must endure. Paint shields the steel from the sea's bite, and the bridge becomes the ship's mind. Let's get this done. Awesome. Looking good. At last, the form is whole. 
Yet a ship is not born until it touches water. Now the giant awaits the sea. Wow, look at it go! Amazing, it's really moving now. From blueprint to steel, from sparks to waves, a cargo giant is born. It will carry the lifeblood of trade across oceans, connecting nations, feeding cities, fueling worlds, built by hand, by fire, by endurance. It now belongs to the sea.